Previously on The Contender. For John Wayne Parr. Hey, fellas. A second chance put him back in the game. How do they do the draw now? The new system to use the draws is pretty insane. I didn't want to touch it just in case I juice myself. I got another present too. The draws. Really? Yep. Uh, Last eight. Being sick and out of the loft, I really got my focus back now. And the contender bracelet, it's a good reminder that I'm here to fight and I'm here to win. In training, Zidov got some one on one attention. Well, I'm more about defending, okay? Not too much about attacking. I want to make sure you don't get kicked in the head. Stefan questioned whether it would be enough. Zidov, weight wise, he only sits on 68 kilos, but the other boys are at least 6, 7 kilos heavier than him. So for Zidov, a big punch can be the end of the fight. But the oh. cards told a different story. Oh! Zidoff has a card game where he predicts the future of the fights. I actually do sort of believe a little bit what Zidoff's doing with the cards. He's been pretty much on the money so far. I win. I win this round. I win Jomei Pan! <laughs> Lord, I just lost to Zidoff. Devastated. And when it was time to see who would face off, this ancient Chinese chest of drawers now holds your fate. The chest match, Sean versus UK. We have a match. In the ring, both fighters gave their all. But it was Sean who proved to be the stronger competitor. And UK from Sweden was the 10th fighter to leave the loft. Only six fighters remain. Two will fight tonight. The winner stays, and the loser goes home. Winning that fight got me to the final four, which is great. Fall my heart out. At this stage, I know I've earned something contender. The cards have been my favourite so far, so hopefully it's a sign of things to come. In my next fight, I'm just going to dig deep and push through. So I'm going straight into the semis. I'm totally uninjured and I'm upset to go. I was expecting to see five rounds. But... Yeah. Sean is the top four. Yeah. Yeah, no, I think Sean, Sean, your tank like good fight. Rob Rob, six good fight. I'm Ling Chuan. He's got show quality. Let the people see that he's got a good fight. And this is why I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. You're not giving a hundred percent. You present fights, you know. It's not my fault. Sean's had two fights now. Both fights uh, ended pretty fast in the first round and then the second round. So he's got a 
big advantage for impression in the semi-finals. How was feeling the, to be in the semi-final? Awesome. Final four, four, eh? Final four. It's gone from 16 to 6, so it's exciting because now we're getting that step closer. We can see the light at the end of the tunnel, but um, whoever makes it to the next round, we're in for a hard night. Your single is amazing, and Sean's just, uh, just a little workhorse. It's going to be a, a tough road to get, get to the final. And now we are only 6. Hey, huh? This is big for us. This. this is huge. Yeah. <laughs> We've been in this loft for a few months now, and uh, we're starting to go stir crazy a little bit. <laughs> What's this drum mine? Hey? Did you do this? <laughs> it's just a way, a way of keeping amused. We don't have a TV, we don't have newspapers, so yeah, we just got to play practical jokes on each other to, to keep us entertained. Bit. You know, I just wanted to keep the joke going. You know, someone got me, so I thought I'd get somebody else. See, first time when Soren started the joke, he was all the time really serious. Uh, it's not a problem for me if I beg the beach. After a while, uh, it was a competition of pranks, you know. Outside the ring, you are like small kids. I put the uh, Yotza Klai's shoes somewhere, but I see he get angry. I hope nobody tell him. If you know, I think he's going to try to kick my ass. You know, and this is what we need. I'm the champion of pranks, so of course I want to have the last laugh. <laughs>